Uh, I wanted to demonstrate this team of Jing Yang. Uh, it's a character I kind of built uh, early last year when I first got her, and I got her to like C2. Uh, I think I used her with my Yan Fei team uh, as a replacement for Beido. I believe it was like sort of Sayu, Yan Fei, Dana, and Beido. But I replaced Beido sometimes with Jing Yang for that pyro resonance. Outside of that, I, I didn't really use her too much. Um, and so with this upcoming uh, Dendro uh, addition with like Burgeon and Hyper Bloom and how that sort of all panned out, um, I haven't. I, I wouldn't say this is recommended, but if you've got her and you don't know what to do with her, this might be an option. I suppose is, is what I'm throwing out there. Uh, is this good? I, I don't know either if it's that good. I can't figure out in my. In my I need to probably research it a bit more if uh, the Dendro damage that is occurring if it's even being scaled with her or not, but I, I don't know. We're going to go over it anyway. New artifacts set. I got Wanderer, and we got this Flower of Paradise set, and I initially thought it might be good for Barbara. It possibly is, but I think Gilded Dreams is generally probably a bit more versatile uh, for what you're doing um, because it's a specific reaction this is doing, but I did notice I had some spare pieces for this. Uh, and I decided with Jing Yang, she wouldn't take much uh, for me to ascend her and to just build her, to give her a go, to see, see how see how it works. And I built her and uh, Razor recently at the same time in a similar style. I didn't like EM Razor. I think you need a blend of both EM and physical. And I actually just got a physical piece of this set. So I might actually give that a go with Razor again, and that might be an upcoming video. But anyway, I want to, they were initially going to be both, but I said I've, I've not not followed through with that so uh she's got a full set five piece set here it, it's not been as farmed as much it's just some of these have landed defense which has kind of worked out in that way um and i'll go over the stats as well this this uh flat uh, feather could be doing a ranking up but it's actually got nice sub stats there for her uh, elemental mastery and then we've got defense and then a uh, crit rate i actually thought that was defense again but i think i might have another they're putting out a defense piece there i don't know if that would be better I don't know if that would be better to put the defense piece on. I just have a flat defense. I'm not too sure, but uh, this has actually worked out as a very fun team, which is why I'm doing the video. There is a there is a reason to the madness here. Uh, here's the stats: 46% crit rate, 67% crit damage. Not great. A uh, bit of energy recharge. And, uh, I don't know what the resistance is there or resonance. I don't know. Uh, constellations. I just got her C3, and the talents could do a bit of ranking. We've got three, uh, five, and five essentially. Uh, I, these will go up to six. I'm not too sure about normal attack because I don't really normal attack with her. The weapon-wise, I think this energy one's meant to be good for her, but I, this isn't what I wanted to do. I wanted to try and utilize an EM-based weapon, uh, and I initially had the three-star weapon you have, the Bloodstained Chivalry or something it's called like that. And Razor had this Rain Slasher. Well, since I got rid of that, and uh, she's given the rain slasher to her, and it's actually okay. I, I don't know again if this is if this is good. This is just kind of <laughs> pieced together what I've got, uh, and it's actually been a lot of fun, which is why we're doing it. My other characters like Barbara, I can quickly show, but for the most part, she's got EM weapon, uh, and I believe she's changed since the video. But the video is predominantly the same pieces, uh, Gilded Dream set with attack, uh, which this was an energy recharge, but it's got attack piece. Uh, Sorry, yeah, this is sorry, attack piece. So I'm going a bit over myself. Uh, and then an EM piece and then a crit rate piece, uh, which I think in my video I had an energy recharge, uh, EM, same one, and uh, a crit damage. And that was still good, but this is definitely better. Um, I think elemental mastery scales on attack and crit. I think it's a bit, it's all a bit voodoo to me how it all really works. But anyway, we've, we've waffled a bit too much. But uh, for the most part, this has been really fun. This fourth slot, I've been, you can put like sucrose in, but not always is sucrose that needed. Uh, and there's definitely a method to this team, or you can just do what I'm instantly doing and just kind of spam, spam everything and just met bar. This is kind of again like a DPS Barbara sort of team. But there is generally a method that's probably better, which I'll go through separately. You can argue it's a bit tricky. Right, so like here. 
And it hit for Dendro there for like 10,000, 10, but I don't know who did that. I think it was Jing Yang, but it could just be scaling off of Barbara's bloom damage. I'm I'm not a hundred percent. I assume it could be bloom damage because that's kind of what Barbara does. But uh, in many ways, you basically almost want to choose either Kuki or Jing Yang, and it's kind of best to go with Barbara. Make them wet. Use the apply the Dendro. Apply more wet status. Increase the blooms that are happening on the field. And then when you've got quite a sufficient amount of blooms, use Jing Yang's uh, skill, essentially. Uh, and if you can hit multiple people with that, it actually generates like a, a pyro a sort of burst each, each few seconds. And that, we're going to kill something else. I've killed a lot of stuff, but we, we can go and kill something else. Um, I think there's a... We'll just go there. I'm pretty sure there's a... I can't remember what they're called. Go, Barbara, go. It wouldn't probably be uh, an Abyss team, though, I don't think. I think there's one of these monsters over there. Oh, he's all the way to the other side. I guess there's a group of people here we can we can go for everybody. Probably not enough to demonstrate what I want to demonstrate. never smash those rocks. I think they respawn. That's making it look like I've never seen them. Go, Barbara, go! Yeah, so that did 10k, you see, on the, on the explosion. There. I assume that's King Yang, to be honest. I don't know. This kind of works. It just kind of works. I've been having a lot of fun with it. Um, I wouldn't have built it as like I have now if I didn't think it was going to work. Uh, you can generally get a good idea from lower levels if something is going to work or not. And Razor was alright, but he needed like too much field time. And then like his EM wasn't, say, as almost good as Kuki's. Hyper bloom damage, even though my Kuki's HP scaling, she's not. She's not been built for any mental master. And the shield's been useful as well. Outside of this, though, I I'm not too sure. I said. Uh, I said about like, my Yan Fei team at the beginning. That was a viable option. So like right now, we need Dendro again. Let's dance. Do that, and then we can do that, and it explodes. And you see, there's like some damage was like 400. So I don't know if that's just like the lower level of it, eh? or if that's literally the damage he's doing in the 10k's Barbara. Could well be. Could well be. 
Okay, let's go and kill some more things, and then uh, I'll leave it there. I'm not too sure now. I've, I've done my usual route. I know there could be quite a few enemies around here, so we can go... We can go and do a few of these. No, again, I've kind of been around here earlier as well. Oh, the pitch has changed. I never even noticed that. But she's on the banner. Most people consider her an a sort of an F character. Um, it's not bad. It's not bad. It's got, everyone's got their use in this game, I think, that's for sure. There's a chest down there, of course there is. Not these guys. Yeah, here we go. This this guy, the group here, and there's probably another group up there. But uh, whatever. How do you find? Your journey ends here. A bond is strong. I'll settle this. Let the show begin. Yes, you go. Again, Jing Yang Sing because it hit multiple people. Her cooldown on her skill can be kind of tricky to time, because I think it's like 15, it's like 15 seconds or so. So it's quite long. Right, let's get Dendro on and the crocodile man here stood no chance. Yeah, it's been a fun team. Very fun. Very fun. Like the 50th time. Let me go and kill something else before we, we, we wrap it up here. Oh, here we go. Here we go. And there's a chest for our trouble as well. They're lined up. You gotta like that. Yeah, all three of them, so this will start doing its thing, which is nice. Let's get Barbara on, let's do this. You tell him. Once again, everything just kind of dies. And you, you can build Jingyang as a physical unit. Um, I would avoid it, really. And I think as well, you could also have a with uh, Crimson Witch of Flames. That might be a better option. And you could argue I've had some pieces that would probably be more suitable uh, than this this Flower of Dice, uh, Flower of Paradise Lost. Oh, man. Oh, man. That's funny. Uh, but, yeah, I don't know. Give it a go. Uh, I, I do notice that most people don't actually build a lot of their characters. I even saw someone the other day that hadn't built, like, Dono and Fischl and uh, some other great units. They didn't even build, like, Zhang Ling and stuff like that. I was like, oh, God. You know, and I think that's quite normal for a lot of people. They'll just build, like, their favorites, and there'll be, like, six to eight characters, and that's it. So whatever. But if you clicked on this video and you enjoyed it, please leave a like, and thank you very much for watching.